Interactive ATV trails. Finishing up trail 159 within the American Fort Canyon OHV system. Uh, it was a little bit more challenging than the first, the other trails that we've ridden, uh, just because the, the initial approach is pretty rocky, and it's, it has a lot of large rocks, and uh, it's not real steep. It's just real rocky and narrow, uh, so you have to kind of uh, proceed cautiously over those if you're a beginner. Uh, there's not a lot of room to avoid those. You just have to pick your line selection, make sure your body's in the right position, you have good balance, and you should have no problem going over those. Uh, once the trail flattens out, it gets a lot smoother. It's not nearly as rocky or rooty. And um, as you get closer to the end of the trail, you start to run into some logs that the Forest Service has put in the, in the trail to to control erosion and such, but those are a lot of fun to go over. Um, overall, I thought it was a blast. I thought it was a real good trail uh, to ride. It's, I would say, moderately difficult, probably on the easier side of moderately difficult, uh, because it's just, uh, aside from the rocks, it's really not that challenging. There are no switchbacks to, th to speak of. It's a pretty straight, it's pretty, pretty straight trail. Uh, it's not steep. And uh, overall, I think beginners would have a great time honing their skills on this, getting their, you know, getting a little bit more quality seat time and uh, just get more comfortable with the bike over some rocky technical, somewhat technical sections. They're really not, not that technical. Um, but anyway, Connor, our youngest rider, he's eight years old, uh, he's gonna tell you what he thought of the trail. So take it away, Connor. I like the logs that you go over. It's really bumpy and the uh, rocks are a little hard and I haven't felt fall fell once. Good job. Yeah, Connor's doing a great job on the couple trails we've ridden so far. He's really torn it up. He's only laid the bike down once, which is a huge improvement. He's getting he's getting a lot better. But the the story here is, if you're teaching your your youngsters how to ride, is you got to sometimes take them outside their comfort zone, and by doing so, you'll help them uh, gain those skills that are necessary to tackle more challenging terrain. And Trail 159 will do that. It'll teach them how to how to maneuver around some of those obstacles. So in, in summary, uh, Trail 159 is a great trail. It's uh, moderately difficult, but on the easy side.